everybody, it's Pastor Ron on location at Indian Park, just a few blocks from downtown Cape. And over the years, I've driven by here many times and uh, see it filled with folks. Right in front of me, there's a basketball court. That's a real popular spot, especially in the summer months. Uh, right now, it's really cold out here, and I'm the only one here. <laughs> uh, but behind me, some playground equipment for kids. And just to my left is a pavilion with uh, picnic tables. And... Um, I don't know about you, but when I see parks, I have uh, happy, fond memories of bringing my kids out and uh, enjoying the playground equipment and just getting outside. And um, we're blessed in Cape with so many good parks. But this particular park has a couple memories that aren't so happy associated with it. In recent years, there have been a couple murders here. So how do you, uh, how do you reconcile that to a park with murder? Playground equipment for kids and violence? It just, it just doesn't seem right because it's not. It's wrong. And we ask questions like this. How, how can we believe in, that God is good when there's so much suffering and evil in the world? Is it possible to, to, to be a believer with all of that um, contradictory evidence out there? Well, those are the questions that thinking people ask. Those are the questions that people struggling in their faith ask. Honestly, those are the questions that we all ask. Uh, and those are the questions we're going to begin asking this weekend at LaCroix as we start a new series called Good God? Question mark. And we're going to uh, delve into some topics that honestly keep some people from coming to wholehearted faith in Christ. So invite some friends with you, especially some friends who uh, have some real doubts and questions. Uh, this could be a really, really helpful series for them. Brett's going to kick it off this weekend with a look at violence in the Bible and how do we reconcile that with God's goodness. It's going to be a great series. I look forward to sharing it with you. So look forward to seeing you in worship this weekend at LaCroix.